stay here and guard the car. So today we are up here playing in the mountains. So our first stop is a place called Left Hand Fork. So we're going to go see the river and let Caitlin run off some energy because she wants to play and it's hard for little kids to sit in the car. So I wish we just lived here. Like it wasn't a, a thing to go to the mountains. It was just where our home was. Someday. Say hi, mommy. Woo! Did you see the water yet? Do you want to go over here and see the water? She's trying to find hoppers, isn't she? Yeah. Good job. Hi, Stay up there. Stay here right I with mama. I want you mama. to sit with mom, okay? Good job. A fog down. Yeah. Here's a couple cool ones. Okay, you ready? Okay. Woo! Okay. Stay up there. I got a look. Where are we, what are we doing? And throwing rocks in the water. <laughs> you were right. Is that fun? <laughs> She's waiting for more rocks now. <laughs> uh uh. Uh uh. Hey, Daddy, we'll bring one. Look, he's catching them for you, honey. See? Rocks. Okay. Okay. Trying to look through the camera and not fall down this. Okay, into the water. Okay, let's, okay, let's go walk through the grass and find hoppers. And there's all these pretty yellow trees down here. All she cares about is the rocks. And dirt. You found your, your river, your rock for the river? Okay. Okay. That thing's big. This one's big. Look. It's a lot. Can you hide a water? Yep. Oh. Well, careful. It's right here. Yeah. But it's water. This is a better spot for you, huh? My spot. Yeah. Oh my gosh, there's more feathers too. Holy cow. There's a lot of feathers. Maybe we'll go to this other side then. Okay, we'll just look at the feathers, but I don't want to be playing in them. That's... What even was? You think that's a grass from just one? It looks like someone plucked it. Oh, maybe they were hungry. Probably gathered it somewhere and plucked it and cooked it right there. Maybe they cooked it right there. <laughs> All right, Caitlin, hold on. Okay. Hey. Ready? Whoa. Whoa. That was a good throw. sense. Smart. So now we are at a place called Beaver Mountain to eat lunch and play and maybe find wildlife. We'll see. So cute. 
cute. Oh boy. Okay, Dad. Okay, Dad. I have no idea what angle to get it from. Right like that. It's a Is it? It's a song? It's the light that I'm not good at figuring out. Yeah, I know. That's good. Hi, Caitlin. Hi. Yeah, we're swinging for a minute. I'm the red one. I'm the red one. Okay, you gotta hold on tight, though. Yeah, you're not pulling much faster. <laughs> These aren't very good for balancing. Or one point of contact there. <laughs> Good swing in. Yeah. I'm smiling big. Hi, Caitlin. Are you a happy camper? Oh, yeah. Good job. Let's see if we can walk over there before it stops swinging. So we just left Beaver Mountain and Brian found elk droppings and ear droppings in the area that, so that means that that's the area where he can get an elk. So that means that they're there, they're around. Now we decided to drive a mile down the road to come and see Bear Lake and it's finally the blue color that I've been trying to get all summer, but it just hasn't, the lighting and the clouds have not been right, but today it's the right color of blue. You excited, Caitlin? Yeah, the last time we came here was in the summer with the cousins and we got to go play on the beach in the water. Now it's, that was in the summer and now it's fall. So obviously we're not going swimming today, but we, it is still worth the stop to look at the water. Hey, I did that. <laughs> did you see a hopper? Up a little bit. Okay. Hey. Okay. 
Come on, Giggles. Let's go see what's in there. <laughs> she ran right out of your boot. She ran through my legs, and I stepped on her boot. And <laughs> can you get it on, honey? Need help? It's a big girl. You are a big girl. Okay, let's try this again. All right, Goofy. No, that's how that happened. <laughs> you have yeah. to. Keep moving. Come on, Caitlin. You want to come have a drink? Come here. Yeah, come here. Hi, Caitlin. Are you doing shakes? Getting all wound up. Well, I thought not being twisted up was better. Hi. <laughs> Hi, monkey. Oh, oh. You made it. Hi. Try sweet pea. Are you all done with those shakes? So we've been home for hours now, it's dark outside, but our mountain adventure was really fun. Especially since tomorrow we get to spend the day at the hospital for Caitlin. So getting out to Rome is a good thing. Are you ready to go to the hospital tomorrow, Caitlin? Yeah, you are? Are you a big girl? Yeah. You're a tough girl, aren't you? Hi. Hi. This. What are you drawing, Caitlin? A rainbow. A rainbow? Do you love coloring? Hi. 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 Mom. Hi, Caitlin. Hi, Daddy. Hi, Caitlin. Hi, Flo. <laughs> Hi, Hi. Flo. This little gal has clinic tomorrow. What do you think? You're going to do great if I could hold the camera straight. It's my work. Oh, yeah? Okay. So it's not very often that we get to eat out twice in one day, but today is one of those days. And I uh, got Panda Express. What you doing? Well, that's Dad's. You ready to eat? Okay. I know. Suck white rice, maybe.
Well, Caitlin, what do you think about the new configuration? Do you like that? Do you like the new shelf? This one's a anchor. That is a crocodile. So it's taken us like, I don't know, three weeks or so to get this all sorted out because the microwave stopped working one day so we went and bought one, but it was too big for the shelf that we were using. So it's just been sitting on the kitchen table. It was sitting on the kitchen table until our shelf that we ordered from Amazon got here. Well, the shelf got here, but it didn't have the assembly hardware with it. So yesterday, we finally made it to Home Depot to try to find some bolts. Apparently they were too small, so tonight Brian looked through the various hardware and the toolbox and thankfully was able to find four bolts that would work. So finally it's over. It's one of those things like that took way longer than it probably should have to be resolved. But now that it's resolved, it's awesome. So with that, it feels good to solve problems. So maybe solve one of your problems today. That's a good thing to do. Even yeah, if it's just stupid living problems like getting a new shelf for your microwave tomorrow like we said we have clinic so should be good i think that well it'll be a good thing tomorrow at the hospital so we will say goodbye and we'll see you in the morning caitlin you want to say bye bye